So, uh, hello, lovely people. Um, so, uh, I will uh, explain about the armoring massage. So, um, uh, just one second. Do you see that? Oh, yeah, I found it. Okay, so um, um, uh, now I will explain about the armoring massage, how we're going to do this. Uh, so, um, yes, uh, we found, uh, I show you uh, exactly where are the areas where uh, we need to look. Uh, and uh, then uh, uh, each of you will uh, find uh, the points uh, in, uh, at the beginning of each session three most uh, painful points and most triggering points uh, and um, then we will uh, the man will give the session to the woman uh, and um, uh, he would um, uh, press uh, the most uh, painful point for about 15 20 minutes depends from the energy of the group and uh, then uh, we will do a little bit of um, uh, yes, energetical touch uh, to spread this energy for around five minutes, and then uh, we do the second painful point. Uh, sorry. <laughs> so uh, then uh, we will do the same with the second point. Uh, yes, 15 minutes, uh, 20 minutes um, pressing uh, to the limit of the pain of the receiver. She is choosing the limit. And then again, energetical touch for five minutes, spreading the energy. And then uh, uh, the third point. And then energetical touch, and uh, we will change the roles afterwards, and then the woman will give the uh, same session to the man. So she, first she will look for the points uh, in the areas where uh, I'm going to show you and then um, she will give the same session. Mm. So that's the uh, idea. So uh, I will give you the presentation how to do. I will explain you now uh, how uh, what is all the, in this DR morning. Uh, so there are a few areas uh, of the body uh, where we look for the most painful points, yes? And uh, those areas are uh, like uh, under the clavicula. Uh, um, so uh, then uh, it's uh, between the nipples, uh, the bridge here, the hole here, so in this triangle. So, uh, uh, always uh, between the bones, so, so it's uh, like emotions. Emotions uh, are, it's like water, yes? And the water goes always down and it gets stuck in the some holes. Yes? So all those points are also like in the holes. They are, they are never on the top mm -hmm. of the uh, bone, but in the hole between. So we we'll, we we'll look. Uh, uh, this is another area where to look, and then uh, 
The third area would be under the ribs. Um, and then the fourth, it's like the psoas. So if someone has six pack, you have you see the line. If not, then you measure the half um, distance between the navel and the edge of the body, and then you press like this. And you go very deep and then you press towards the neck. And then the last area, it's uh, on the inside of the um, hips. So it's uh, like here and uh, like up till uh, the soft area. So especially with the woman, you don't press further because the ovary is there, so we don't want to press that. So on the inside part of the hips, basically. So from here. So uh, those are the areas what we will look for those three points. So. Um, um when we find them we're gonna start the uh, like uh, the morning session of each point That's and how we do it uh, uh, during when we look for the points we communicate only through the numbers 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 one two three uh, but you mean you say one two three or one? yes so yeah uh, so there is scale of the pain from one to ten. So you mean communicating through numbers? You mean about the scale of the pain? Yes. Значи се комуникира с числата за обаче за болка. Колко си има тази артерия? So there is scale from the one till ten about your pain limits. So, like one, it's uh, uh, nothing. It's and nice touch. And ten is extremely too much. You cross the line. So um, eight is great. Uh, it's uh, painful, great because it's your choice of your limit. So it's the pain what you can still bear, but the nine is already too much. You cannot bear it. Even you wish to go as far as possible, nine is just too much. So seven is uh, too soft. Six is uh, more too soft, and five is uh, a lot too soft, and four is like, uh, are you joking? It's no painful at all. It's a little bit painful, yeah, but um, no problem. So, uh, yes. Um, um, the intention is that the receiver stay all the time on eight. On the edge of uh, your limits, your boundaries. There where we used to grow, we used to heal. Yes, uh, out of our comfort zone and uh, yes. Um, the place where the, it changed, but also, yes, on the edge of your limits that you are not traumatizing yourself. So, um, uh, basically, a receiver is um, uh, uh, requesting for the level of the pain uh, she is asking for. So she can suffer. She can feel the pain, she can feel maybe emotions, and then, ah, but if she's still saying eight, you keep the same pressure. So, 
това е идеята на според мен. Ще пожелаеш да поддържаш същия, същия натиск. So, as deeper you go, you have deeper healing effects. Толкова по-надълбоко ти, толкова по-дълбоко е. But again, uh, do not traumatize yourself by uh, uh, going over your limits. Да не се травматизираме, като минаваме линии. Don't make too much like mind, oh, now I have to go through or I have to suffer and whatever, oh, I'm the man, uh, uh, these kind of things. No, no. You have to just feel, okay, this is bearable, this is okay, but this is too much, okay. So I say nine, yes? I take care for myself. And only when we are honest with it, the giver can know that, okay, I do it out of love. The person wants to be healed. Идеята е, че трябва да сме честни с колко ни болката, не да се пренабиваме да го издържиме и по този начин може да кажем на този, който натиска или да го прави от любов, т.е. натиска точно колкото трябва, за да може човека да си излекува, но без да му имаме граници. I can trust that person, that uh, they care for themselves, that I'm not gonna traumatize, but heal that person. Идеята е, че този, който получава болката, ще бъде честен и да може другия, който натиска, да не ги травматизира, а да ги излекува. Тоест, да знае, че те са недостатъчни. So, uh, very often, yes, we, uh, it's to inflict uh, pain uh, on someone, uh, especially someone who we love, uh, is against our uh, human nature. Uh, това да направим да причиним болка на този, който както обичаме, е, е срещу нашата природа. And that's completely right. That's how it's supposed to be. И това е все нормално. But uh, in this massage, understand that like in Thai massage or Swedish massage, as harder, as more pain there is, then more healing potentials. И в тези масажи, колкото повече болка има, толкова повече е And повече understand that uh, The person who is uh, giving you the trust that you will press them and inflict that pain, they do it for their own request. They want to be healed, that's why they choose the aid for that way of healing. If they don't want to go too deep, they would choose very soft aid. And that's also okay. They will have less healing, but uh, uh, at least, I don't know, they will not traumatize themselves. So whatever, um, the, it's all your choice, yeah? Um, And we as a givers, we kind of do the best of their choice. So we do it out of love. Even uh, if uh, it's um, not uh, nice for us to see our beloved ones uh, in feeling pain, uh, still Okay, maybe it's not nice, but she knows, okay, she would be healed, she's choosing for it. I do it out of love. So, yes, um, after um, uh, this point being pressed for about 15-20 minutes, uh, The emotion uh, probably will be released from that point and uh, the person may not feel pain anymore, over-exaggerated, strong pain uh, there. Uh, my first dear morning sessions, uh, when I uh, experienced it, uh, uh, afterwards I felt like uh, such a openness for the perceiving the senses. Uh, I felt like uh, high, very high, 
uh, almost like on ayahuasca, but without the uh, hallucinations. And uh, yeah, fully present. Yeah. Uh, I could see more colors, I could feel more energies around. So it was uh, like amazing uh, because, uh, yes, you remove all these armors and uh, then you can uh, perceive more with your senses. And some other senses even are uh, felt without. Uh, so uh, we do always the armoring before the full body orgasm without touching massage because sometimes yeah this is the moment where uh, we may feel after the armoring um, session more um, energetical touch that was the first time when I felt uh, my energetical touch after the dearmoring session. In this moment between the pressing the point. Pressing the point. So, um, yes. Um, Mm. I wish uh, you may have very nice feeling afterwards and it's worthy um, even if it's you will not uh, feel like uh, after the LSD but uh, on pre like present not hallucination <laughs> so, uh, and you have more uh, feelings maybe uh, uh, in tomorrow um, doing the full body orgasm without touching massage. So, yes, um, mm, uh, communicate only through the numbers. And all numbers. There is no like uh, seven and a half, six and a half. No, uh, there is no. Oh, um, uh, this is uh, too much. Uh, because th uh, this too much, we don't know how much is too much, yes? <laughs> After pressing uh, for some time, uh, you will develop very clear understanding uh, where is the eight of the person, where is the seven, how uh, much you, uh, when the person is saying seven or six, how much uh, uh, stronger you have to press. So, uh, uh, important that you communicate only through the numbers. And especially at the beginning of the session, uh, when uh, you start to press this one point, you communicate every five seconds. And every time when you change the sensation. So this is very important. Um, so the uh, giver is keeping asking every five seconds if the person do, do not say it themselves. And the receiver, uh, please, at the beginning especially, say every five seconds the number.
и т.е. който получава да през 5 секунди да коментира своето начало. Or even more often uh, any time when the sensation change. Или по-често в зависимост на самията на сензация. Yes, later on you may feel okay, you are still all the eight all the time. Yes, you kind of find the way of pressing. You don't have to do it with such a frequency, but at the beginning, first one, two minutes, three minutes, do it. В началото, докато сме нели къде точно е смисълта, се коментира по-често. Вече когато се намери къде After five minutes, maybe you got the feelings. You may only do it uh, when the uh, sensation changed. So you maybe could feeling oh now it's seven, and you change. Например, ако е станало от 8 до 7, ти така вече се променил, за да може да промениш нещо. So, um, um, the, it's a work for the person who is giving the massage. So it's a work. It's a work, it's a job. Това е като работа за този, който натиска. Especially if uh, you are a small girl and you give the massage to the big guy, mus muscular guy. So use your body weight, like um, uh, don't do like this, because that's your muscle will get tired, do like this. You may support uh, your uh, finger uh, with uh, another finger and another hand, yes? Um, sometimes uh, the people who are giving the massage have more pain than uh, those who receive with the fingers. <laughs> so take care for yourself, yes? When you feel the finger is getting painful, uh, you may change the finger, but then, uh, yes, say it always, I'm changing the finger, and do it very slowly. So you change maybe to another hand uh, or another finger, and especially if you change to another hand, it's like yin and yang side, and it's sometimes completely different feeling. For some people, you may notice that uh, changing the fingers is uh, one of the most painful. So do it slowly because. Uh, the eight what you had can be uh, very quickly, uh, very soft uh, on the other hand. Uh, if you feel, uh, you may use the knuckle. Yes, so uh, if uh, it's too painful or you may not to want to cut your nails, uh, you attach too much. If uh, the uh, guy is very muscular yeah. and the girl is uh, small, uh, it's allowed also to use the elbow, but uh, it's very important that you are as more precise with the location. Yes? When you find the points, uh, um, you first, uh, yes, you um, kind of mark them. You, uh, some people actually mark them with the pen uh, to not to forget. Uh, so when you find three most painful points, before starting the session, you uh, check this very specific location. So, uh, sometimes moving only uh, half centimeter or a few millimeters one side or another 
can be a huge difference. Especially it's hard, uh, you have delicate fingers. Uh, uh, it's uh, much better if you choose uh, easy point to uh, press for you, then you don't have to work so hard. Uh, it's um, better to uh, do exact <coughs> um, examination, yeah? Mm -hmm. Then you don't have to uh, uh, suffer with pressing too much. So look around this point, yeah? If you feel like, okay, this was the point, then you look a little bit here, a little bit there, a little bit there. Uh, okay, w where exactly is the best, the most stronger option? Yeah? So, yes, um, mm, the sensation may change over the time. Uh, when the point it's the uh, uh, armored, the blocked, uh, the emotion is gone. The point, like what was uh, very sensitive, can be not sensitive at all. It means it, this over exaggerated pain is gone, the emotion is gone. So, um, however, we uh, keep all the group till uh, the time is over. You may uh, feel, okay, you don't have to press it or you have to press much harder sometimes. Sometimes you may feel uh, literally that uh, the body is kind of pushing you out. So that means uh, it's more or less healed, like uh, <laughs> always when uh, you do uh, another session on the same person, that would be completely different points. Because all those points uh, were what were needed healed are already healed. So, um, yes, um, mm. so, uh, um, the uh, the armoring points are all over the body. I'm gonna teach you only on the torso because that's the most popular way of the armoring. And here are en enough points uh, to uh, yeah, keep you busy for uh, some time. Uh, uh, usually the first session is the most uh, efficient one because you <coughs> get the most uh, painful. Um, as I said, the yoni massage is the most de armoring massage, uh, but we do it on other models. And it's a different way of... Uh, but the idea is also similar, to let out the emotion. Emotion with this uh, massage uh, most common is the anger. Um, those points are the, in the specific areas. They're not like any points in the body. Like uh, if I press myself here, I will just make myself bruise. I will not heal anything because there is no emotion there or whatever. Yes. So they are in the specific uh, areas. Yes. So only do uh, when you're sure 
that you are in good area yes uh, you will if you are not sure you may check the video afterwards okay mm. yeah there would be many things coming up when during the uh, presentation um, so i guess niejakie uh, вопросы Uh, so, uh, uh, the best that you used this not nail part, yeah? If um, uh, you, as a receiver, feel nail, you just say nail. Uh, because, uh, yeah, then we m w are sure that we have to either polish or either change the position of the finger, maybe use the knuckle, yes? But we don't want to make eight with the nail and then we have the wound. <laughs> Expect every each of you probably will have bruises for a few days. But we don't want to have cut it wounds, yes? <laughs> А може ли след вярно в бъдник сесия да продължим и на разчистването на емоции? Ще да сме ти фактор да вярно в сесия да клиника да може да го просит о ретенция и сесия. Usually it uh, goes uh, out with the session. You will feel uh, much better. Тоест се ще приключи и всичко ще се по-добре. Of course, uh, the process um, may continue and uh, but um, yes if you are here you are choosing to be here uh, universe is at your being is showing uh, that uh, you may feel ready for it most of the sessions are without so much emotions um, it's uh, actually mo uh, most of the time there is just okay i'm go through it like uh, and that's it again like uh, yeah if you uh, have the anger maybe don't shout uh, very strong you can choose always for puna shout <sighs> But I guess that this would be also not so much intimate uh, session. So uh, uh, with this one, uh, it's more okay no, than with the other. Yeah. Um, so the person who is receiving is the full control she is deciding where is the aid yes uh, also keep in mind that uh, hey uh, to not to traumatize yourself with uh, putting your aid too little too, st too, too strong maybe yeah just common sense, yeah? On both sides? Uh, and uh, please, um, only the uh, condition to choose the points is the pain. Nothing else. Criteria. Criteria. Uh, no any chakras, no male side, no female side, no any like symmetry order. Yes. Just the pain is the indication. Uh, I would suggest. Uh, not to choose two uh, points in the same uh, area, for example, uh, two, three centimeters close to each other, yes? 
a bit bigger distance, maybe seven, no that's okay. Distance. So, yes, um, there are many points. If someone is ticklish, uh, yeah, try to uh, go through this ticklish, yes, the, the person can maybe take a few deep breaths and kind of uh, tune into not to be ticklish. But if uh, uh, it's ticklish, yeah, there are uh, many other points uh, to choose, uh, so you can also choose other points. Also, for some uh, any reason, you might feel some fear uh, to. Uh, experience some uh, point uh, pre uh, being pressed you can also choose okay uh, i don't want to be pressed here yeah on the breast area we pull the breast out of the way uh, in the mo woman case yes and uh, we don't want to press on the breast, we want to press between the ribs. So we find a way to go between the ribs. If you feel especially with the breast any uh, lump or some harder thing, never press on it, yes? We're supposed to press between the bones, in the holes only. And uh, you can inform if you find any lumps on the breast, especially to the woman to do some checkup. When uh, we feel certain point for how long it actually feels like uh, in a period of time? It's um, it's um, um, it's here for a long time. Uh, I don't have, for example, so much the same uh, points repeating again. Yeah, usually they are always different. And um, if you really come back to the same habits what you did, that's how we get the same trauma, maybe in the same point. But usually we grow with each of the healing, so we don't uh, allow the same trauma to happen and go into the same area. Do you know which point uh, is connected to which emotion? No, uh, this is uh, completely out of order. This is no any, uh, uh, yes, uh, uh, it's not like in Yoni massage that this one can be connected with this and so. This is completely uh, out random, yeah? But most of those points, as I said, uh, very rare uh, experience on those sessions, uh, the crying. Uh, uh, sometimes anger. Uh, yes, you can do it by your own, but it's a bit uh, um, challenging because uh, it's not easy by yourself to keep yourself at the aid. Um, yeah, I would suggest someone else do it to you. 
Um, yeah. And when you say that yoni massage is more effective, does it mean when you do yoni massage, you also remove these painful points from torso? No, it's uh, the different uh, emotions frozen in different parts of the body. So, um, yeah, yoni massage, you heal mainly your sexuality uh, from the sexual blockages uh, and traumas. Uh, this, uh, yeah, you heal, um, yeah, other emotions, mainly anger, is like, but yes, uh, fear, maybe, you know, like, yeah. And, че е разликата, че когато с йони масаж отклоняваме емоциите, не изпълняваме тези точки, понеже са различни емоции, затова и през йони масаж се разпълнява сексуалността, а през тези точки се отклоняват други емоции, като тези, които вече споменахме, и примерно също тази страхова и нещо от този сорт. В смисъл не можеш да си направиш йони масаж и да изпълняваш тези точки, т.е. да нямаш нужда от тях. Да. Добре? Всичко? Окей. So there would be some questions probably appearing uh, when we do the uh, presentation, yes? So um, okay, it's, it's, uh, you can see if uh, uh, when you lie down if it's uh, So uh, uh maybe just underwear uh, because uh, yeah this uh, a bit like you can also put down however it feels you know that uh, underwear we need underwear for you too <laughs> but uh, uh, no. <laughs> okay <laughs> so uh, uh, if someone can check if uh, she's uh, completely visible or Maybe. Okay. 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 So, um, yes, I will show you now the areas where we are going to look for the points and I will also look a little bit for the points. Uh, so uh, the first area is under the clavicula. Most so. Um, so uh, most of the pressure uh, we will do ninety degrees to the ground. And uh, most of the points are close to the bones, very close. So you stay close to the bones. So, so this is the clavicula here. So we go uh, from the beginning here. Uh, and then we go, 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 go. To the, we feel the ball of the shoulder. So, uh, and then we press with the same uh, pressure. That's how we look for the points. In yes. And she say just the uh, reaction of the number. How does she feel that? So uh, I will press, and you say the number. Mm -hmm. So we press uh, only one point at a time. So if she is saying like three, three, three uh, a few times, uh, I may, uh, it's a signal to increase the pressure. But in general, I uh, try to stay in the same pressure, yes? Number? Four. Mm -hmm. four. Three. Four. 
Okay, so so here uh, we didn't find any points, yes? So uh, the next area is between the nipples, uh, uh, this triangle. Most uh, of... So most uh, of the points could be on the line, the most probability, uh, yes? And I press number four. Number four. So I move uh, the breast, try to move a oh, bit okay, out of the, and go between the ribs, yes? So, uh, up till now, she said like uh, here five, but it was more with the emotion. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So uh, I would, up till now, choose uh, like remember only this here. Yes. Mm -hmm. But there are many points uh, further, so I, uh, probably we might find better ones. Uh, You can also say Bulgarian. Mm -hmm. So uh, I remember two six here. Mm -hmm. yeah. two, six. Two, six. Four, mm -hmm. Okay, so that's uh, about this area. So now I will go um, under the ribs. So under the ribs, we go, um, like you see that line, so you go 45 degrees this direction, and, and 45 degrees uh, the direction uh, to the ground. Yeah? So basically like this kind of. Yeah? So, uh, also you stay uh, close to the rib, yes? So you basically go under the rib, yeah? <laughs> Number? Five, six. <laughs> oh, okay. Number? Okay. Seven. Mm -hmm. Six. Six, seven. Seven. Uh, five. Five. Mm -hmm. I can go wherever it's comfortable for me to press. Okay. So when person you can feel when person have emotion with the point, 
this seven is more better than the other one, yeah? Когато намерим точка, която е с емоция, когато човек казва емоция, това, тази седмица е по-добра от друга седмица. Also sometimes uh, the pain can radiate to other areas. И понякога самата болка може да отива и в други точки. If you feel so, you can say it also. Then you know this, I would choose more for this one than the other ones. И това ще би избра тази точка, колкото други. You also can feel some energy going when I press. So this is also better indication than the other. Това може да се, ако усетим някаква енергия, това може да бъде по-добра индикация. So you say, like yes. Mm. Basically, uh, it's not me is choosing, but we both choosing. Yeah? So че избирате двама. Number? Five. Okay, so this is uh, about the ribs. Yes, so we remember there was some sevens here. So now the psoas, uh, it's the longest muscle uh, and uh, all yoga is about to relax this muscle, is all stress about. So if the person doesn't have six pack, uh, uh, we choose the halfway between the edge of the body and the navel. Казва, ако нямаме, ако си имаме слънинки, както казаха, а избираме половината от пъпа и този крадек се получава, избирам по средата. So, uh, when you go here, you go like this to just make sure that all the organs are out of the way. И когато натискаме там, а, внимаваме в началото как той го направи с движението, за да се фокусирам, че всички органи са махнати от пъти. And you press uh, completely 90 degrees to the ground till you feel heart tissue there. When you feel something hard there, you start to press towards the navel. Okay. So uh, and then from the other side the same. Down to you feel Heart tissue, mm, and then <laughs> number seven. Okay, so uh, this we could consider, and then um, we go um, on the inside of the hips. <laughs> number four. 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 Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ticklish, yeah? So try to uh, breathe into it, try to, yeah. Okay. Seven. Oh, okay, seven. 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 Okay. Seven. Mm -hmm. So I don't go any further because uh, there are over is there. It's, uh, Yes. This is a point of those are the actions. Number? Six, four, five, six. Seven. <laughs> seven. Seven. Okay. So um, um, we had seven here, seven here, and uh, like two sevens here. Uh, yeah, there was like six, 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 uh, and yes, here also three. You can um, uh, choose. Um, here she had just three. So I'm just telling you, it's always good to start uh, to choose after you check all the body. The uh, one more time uh, clavicula because uh, sometimes the way how we press, uh, we learn on the way. Okay, this is the exact so. We do with the same pressure just to check. След като проверим всичките точки и за може да се върнем към ключицата, след тъй като вече знаем къде има примерно 7, колко сме натиснали, за да можем на ново да проверим. 5. 5. 6. 7. So you see before it was 3, so I was pressing a little bit softer because yeah. I would not expect any such a resistance. So, yes, these uh, are the areas. Uh, uh, 
това са зоните, ако имате въпроси. If she feels energy is moved to other part, does it make sense to check this other part? No, you just press the point wherever you feel. Питайте, ако проявяте себе на една точка, ако енергията се измести на друга, дали проявяваме друга точка и продължаваме се също точка, с която сме започнали. So, we choose with her which one is the most painful, the second painful and the third painful, yeah? So, we do it like maybe if she's not sure about it, if we are not sure about it, then we press it again, uh, and here we had two seven, so we may choose which one. We don't do two uh, close to each other. We rather choose uh, like. Yeah. 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 And then, uh, yes, exact location, and yes, we then uh, when we know this, then we start to um, to uh, from the most painful, then uh, second would be the second painful, and then the third painful. Ah, след като проведем точките, се избират трите, които са най-болезнени, и се започва от най-силната към най-слабата. So basically, the process is first we find the points. Um, the one which is like here, the one which is um, at the chest and down here. And afterwards, we start to press this point for 15 to 20 minutes. Yes. Oh. And yeah. between, you have like the full body touch yeah. without... Mm -hmm. Yes, the, the energetical touch. So basically, the person rests from pressing and uh, uh, I just move. And when I moved, so if the pain was there, for example, then also I pull the rest of the energy. And move along the spine. And we play for five minutes like this, and then we go to the second point. След като намериме точките, като започнаме, на първа точка не се държи 10-15 минути, 15-20. И след като приключиме с самата точка, се прави това раздвижване на енергията и чак тогава продължаваме към следващата. Тоест намираме трите най-болезни точки в от тези зони. Тоест не е всъщност всяка точка във зона. Тоест не е всъщност всяка точка във зона. Може ли да работим на тези мишечки на едно ниво, нали? От двете страни. She's asking if we can work on these two points even if they are on the same level, but they are on the sides. Yeah, that's completely okay. They are like in different areas, so it's fine. Uh, it's uh, just uh, randomly it happened that uh, they are uh, kind of symmetrical. So forget about symmetry. It's uh, just co coincidence, uh, you know, like, but... Като намерим точките, ако са на една, ако са така от две страни, окей, но не търсим и симетрия. Тоест, възможно е. We don't choose too close to each other because, uh, yes, it's uh, a bit too much for uh, uh, so much pain to experience in one area. Another time, yeah, maybe we she would choose the that other point, you know. Okay. And now, when she has several seven, is is it her choice or your choice we choose? Is it both? Both. We discuss. We discuss like which one it's the most painful, most. Когато има няколко точки, които са еднакво силни и се избира между хората, т.е. двамата избират кои да са точките. I help her to choose, basically. She is choosing. Т.е. тя ще си избере кои точки да се натиска. So, yeah. Cool. Okay. So, we start with looking. You have easy job, because...